In this video, you'll learn how to customize your invoices in Xero. When you create an invoice in Xero, you assign it a branding theme. This determines what it will look like when you send it to the customer. Let's check it out. Click the menu icon and select Invoice Settings. Xero provides a standard branding theme with the logo you uploaded in your organization settings. Start by adding payment services. These services allow your customers to pay you online. Choose from a growing list of services we support like Stripe or PayPal. Decide on the payment service you'll use and click Get Started. Then follow the prompts on screen. When the setup is complete, Xero enables the Pay Now button on your invoices so your customers can pay you online. Use the breadcrumbs to return to the invoice settings. You can have multiple branding themes for different customer groups. For example, add a theme for wholesale customers and click New Branding Theme. Enter a descriptive name so your staff know when to use this theme. Adjust the default margins and fonts, as well as the titles of all the documents that Xero will generate from this theme. Turn on and off various settings depending on what you want to show on your invoices. For example, if you don't offer discounts to customers, select Hide Discount. Next, specify how you want Xero to display tax subtotals and currency conversion. If you've added payment services in Xero, select them from the drop down and apply them to this theme. Add terms for invoices and quotes, which Xero displays in the document footer. Align your logo and choose whether you want your invoices to show as tax exclusive or inclusive. And lastly, check that your contact details are correct. Xero takes this information from your organization settings. When you're done, save your changes. Now let's move on to the default settings. Start by choosing the default due dates for invoices and bills. You can override these dates when you create a new invoice or bill. Define the number you want Xero to use when you create your next invoice, credit note or purchase order. For example, carry on where you left off in your previous accounting system. Xero automatically updates the next number with each document you create. Allow customers to see outstanding bills so they can settle all their bills at once. And finally, set a default quote expiration date if needed. Don't forget to save your changes. Next, automate the task of chasing payments and improve your cash flow with invoice reminders. Click the checkbox to enable email reminders. Then click edit to adjust or delete a preset. Tailor the email message and the days overdue as needed. Or take a more proactive approach and send a reminder before an invoice is due. As always, save your changes. There are additional settings that apply to all your reminders. For example, set a minimum owing limit if you don't want to send reminders for small amounts. Once again, save your changes. Now use the breadcrumbs to return to the invoice settings. If you're interested in more advanced customization, Xero lets you upload customized DocX templates. Go to Xero Central to learn more about this. The final step before you start sending invoices is to preview your branding themes. Click Options and select Preview. Review the layout and the general look and feel of the invoice. Then return to the invoice settings to make any changes or improvements.